Today I am going to discuss with you about how to calculate circuit breaker for the MCC. MCC means motor control center. Motor control center means its loads are full of motors. Here we are going to size the size of the circuit breaker of this incoming breaker. Here I mentioned it has MCCB or isolators. In some countries for the incomer MCCB would be used but in some other countries isolator would be used. According to UAE isolator would be used as an incomer for an MCC. These are the MCCBs of the outgoing loads but here I did not mention any breaker rating because here my intention is to find out the size of only the incoming circuit breaker. Here we have different motor loads. One is 5 kilowatt motor load. It is single phase. The second one is 7.5 kilowatt and it is the three phase. And these are all the different types of three phase motor loads. Different types of motor loads means it could be any extract fan or makeup fan or any pump whatever it could be for to find the incoming breaker size first we need to find the full load ampere of all these motors for the full load ampere for the single phase equation is i is equal to p by v into cos theta and for the three phase i is equal to p by v root 3 into cos theta here our voltage for the three phase is 400 and for the single phase is 230 volt. So now we are going to find the full load ampere of 5 kilowatt motor that is a single phase motor. So here this 5 kilowatt into 5.4 we have a shortcut method here if the motor is single phase then we need to multiply the 5 kilowatt with 5.4 then we will get 27 ampere it is a full load ampere it is a shortcut method and the next motor is the 7.5 kilowatt three phase motor and its full load ampere is 7.5 kilowatt into 1.8 so we will get 13.5 ampere just like that for all other motors we already got the full load ampere of these values. You can use this magic values of 5.4 and 1.8 if your voltage is 400 by 230 volt. I already made a video of how to find this 5.4 and 1.8 so if you visit my channel you will get that video. The next step is select the bigger full load ampere from these values. From these values the bigger one is 27 ampere. If the motor is single phase or three phase it does not cause any problem. We just need to find the bigger full load ampere from this one. Now the 27 ampere is the bigger one and now the next step is find the breaker or isolator size. So the equation is the bigger one that is 27 ampere into 1.25 this 1.25 is the safety factor and then you need to sum all the other values and now we got the value of 112.05 ampere it is the breaker size this size of the breaker is not available so the next higher size is 125 ampere so here you can use 125 ampere of mccb or isolator and one important thing you need to remember this method is only applicable for the mcc that means for the motor control center if you are going to find the incoming breaker for any other panel for example for any SMDB or for any MDB you should not use this method for that panels you need to use some other methods that I will explain later in another video 
I hope you got my point. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe my channel and visit my channel and grab more ideas. Thank you.